Hello guys, welcome to another lesson of e-commerce application tutorial series. In this video, we will create our splash screen. Let's begin quickly. First of all, inside the UI package, I want to create one uh, new package. This package name will be our login package. And inside this uh, package, I want to create one more uh, blank empty activity. This will be our splash activity. And inside this splash activity, I want to create, uh, I want to use our base structures. But before that, uh, as you can see, Android Studio automatically creates uh, our layout file, activity splash, and I want to this. I want to change this layout type uh, to data binding layout, like this. <coughs> and let's back to uh, splash activity and delete some uh, this app compact activity. Otherwise, we will use base activity. activity activity splash binding dot splash view model we will create now and this extent of course base view model Now layout id r dot <coughs> layout dot activity splash and also v model class equals to splash v model and uh, we will delete this override function otherwise we have we will uh, implement a, a function on init data binding we will write our code inside this block. But before that, I want to uh, customize our splash activity. I want to add uh, one color into our color.xml file, like this. And I want to change the background uh, color, main color, like this. And inside uh, activity, inside this constraint layout, I want to add one more image view. Uh, this image view will be our logo file width like this and height like this and source will be uh, logo base and <coughs> let's give some constraint using these dots and okay this is uh, our activity splash is ready we can close this uh, panels we are not using right now inside the splash screen is a splash uh, activity I want to create one handler that post delight while intent equals to intent is login activity. That's Java and 
3000 milliseconds. Support action bar. That's height. We don't need to create this login activity right now. Uh, otherwise, we can uh, write main activity. But one more thing uh, we have to make. We want uh, to open our uh, splash activity first. That's why inside the manifest file uh, we have to change uh, one thing. Cut this line and past here, and it will be true. Yes, our error is gone. Uh, let's try to run our application As you can see this is our splash screen uh, that was our splash screen Thanks for watching this lesson. See you the next lesson